Hello and thanks for watching. Today we're going to see how to draw a beryllium atom. So each time you add a proton, you are increasing the atomic number and you're changing to a new element. So 3 is lithium, 4 is beryllium. If you check this box right here, you'll see that this is unstable until you add some neutrons. Now some people think that the neutrons have to equal the number of protons, but that's not always true. In beryllium's case, it's nine total items in the nucleus, four are protons, and five are neutrons. Now we see up here that there's too many positives, which means the protons outnumber the electrons, so we have to add some electrons. The first couple go in the first shell. If you try to add electrons to the nucleus, they're rejected. If you try to add more than two to the first shell, they are bounced. And so we add our electrons to the outer shell. Now that's one too many, so we bring that back, and now it is neutral, and it is stable, which means it has the right number of neutrons in the nucleus. Take this idea and draw it on your paper for your assignment. When you come to your paper, you're going to write the element name over here, beryllium, BE, atomic number 4, and atomic mass of 9, protons equal 4, neutrons equal 5, 4 plus 5 equals 9, 2 electrons on the inner shell, 2 electrons on the outer shell, and that's how we make our beryllium atom. This is not one of the six you can choose from. You have to choose one of the six elements that make up the human body.